Everything in this video can be found on a public domain in the full disclaimers down below. Welcome to the Danger Zone. It's Ashley and I wish you lots of love and many blessings. Okay, so it's been determined that all of that talk about them presenting an award at the Academy Awards this year, nothing more than PR fluff. That's all it was. Just a bunch of PR mess. How bad would it look on them if they skipped over Prince Philip's memorial service and ended up at the Academy Awards giving out awards to these people that don't even like them? And it's also being said that they graciously turned down the invite to give out this award. They said, thank you, but no thank you. We couldn't possibly do it this year. Maybe next. How insane is that? Don't you know Megan would walk through fire, walk on a trail of broken glass to be there? I'm not buying into that for one second, not one. They were not invited. Period. The end. Bottom line. The fact of the matter is, people, actors, actresses, and just guests alike have said that they would boycott the award ceremony this year, had they shown up. If they were to come, these people were going to boycott. I guess get up and walk out. That's how little respect they have for Harry and Meghan. Which, by the way, Harry is now being called the laughing stock of the UK. People are also saying, if anybody deserves the Best Actor and Actress Award, this year, it should be Harry and Meghan for their stint on the Oprah show, or her little sit-down Oprah interview, my bad. They're calling that supreme acting on their end. So don't really expect them to be there. It wouldn't work out to their benefit. Either way, they're going to be chastised for missing Prince Philip's memorial service, and they're going to be boycotted. Nobody wants them there. Nobody has respect for them anymore, if ever. I had a good friend of mine send me a few pictures yesterday and also bring up the fact that, again, this child is bizarre. The whole thing is just bizarre, is it not? Look, it looks like one of those real born babies. Those things are cute as can be, but they're freaky. They're eerily similar to a normal real child, and I believe that's what they introduced Archie that time he was that was a real born doll I don't believe it was a normal healthy living child but there's pieces of these dolls that have their hands positioned the way that Lilibet had hers her feet are identical to the feet you just seen in that mound it's quite bizarre you guys and check out the finger it's so long why is that because it's not authentic it's not a human not in my opinion. It's a doll. I want to say a special thank you to SBS. I appreciate you pointing this out and sharing these pictures with me. Could they get any more strange, you guys? It's so weird to me. I just don't understand it. There's definitely a motive to everything they're doing. I just, I wish we knew for sure what it was. I don't know. We, time will tell. It'll all come out in the wash. It's just a short video I wanted to pop in and share some things with you. I certainly appreciate you spending time with me. I'll see you soon and we'll talk fast. And remember that I love you. And God does too.